hi guys my name is onge welcome to my kitchen today i want to show you how i made my delicious potato mash and for stew in my instant pot so the first thing that i will do is to clean up my potatoes and then wash them and slice them into medium pieces and then i'll take my instant pot and put the rack and about half a cup of water and then i will put my potatoes in and then i will close the lid and pressure cook my potatoes okay so i'm gonna set the timer to 20 minutes on pressure cook and make sure that my lid is on sealing and not on venting so that the steam does not escape Okay, so 20 minutes later my potatoes are ready i'm going to add the vegetable spice then i'm gonna add uh, cream and butter and then mash my potatoes using the mixer from millex that i got from take a lot Okay, so now that I am done with my mesh, I will start making the vors stew in the instant pot. So the first thing that I will do is put my previously frozen onions and peppers on my instant pot and add a bit of olive oil and select the saute option. Then when these are ready, then I'm going to add garlic. Okay, so after adding my garlic, then I will add my tomato paste. Okay, and then I will add my vors and just brown it as well. Okay, and then I'm going to add my spices and then I'm going to add the chicken stock as well you can add beef stock if you want and also I'm going to add my herbs I'm gonna list all the spices that I used in the description box below Okay, then I'm going to add about two tablespoons of chutney. So this is going to balance out the sour taste from the tomatoes that I'm going to add just now. Then I'm going to add the sauce that most of us cannot pronounce, the Worcester sauce. And then I will add my canned tomatoes. And then I'm gonna mix all of this up and then I'm gonna close my oh, before I forget, I'm also instant pot and nice then I'll cancel the saute paper. option and then select pressure cook. and make sure that uh, the lid is on uh, ceiling and then i'm gonna select pressure cook and set the timer to 15 minutes okay so when the 15 minutes is up then i'm going to release my steam and then open my instant pot and look at that it is so delicious then you just stir that a little bit just to make sure that you mix everything up especially the beef stock because it looks like it did not really melt nicely but just stay and then i'm going to dish up my mesh and my walls stew it is so 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 delicious and my family loves it Okay, 
okay so going forward i'm planning to post a video each and every thursday thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe i really appreciate you have a lovely day thank you bye